My name is Andre Dickens and I'm running for mayor of the city of Atlanta. I was born here in Adamsville in Southwest Atlanta. You know this working class neighborhood that right now gives you only a 4% chance of making it from poverty to, pros to prosperity. I grew up with a single mother, a union worker that worked for the phone company. Her biggest dream was for me to become the first person in my family, my whole generations, to go to college. So I took a MARTA bus for 40 minutes every day, going to my middle school and my high school so that I could get this quality education so that I could go to Georgia Tech to become a chemical engineer. I became an engineer and worked for major firms doing big projects and handling complex issues. And then I started my own business. My business headquarters was just 200 yards up the street here on Chattahoochee Avenue, where I grew that business to have three locations, 20 employees, multi-million dollar business where I fed other families first, and then I fed my own after payroll every two weeks. I'm an engineer, so I like to solve problems. So then I went on to run for city council because right here, this was my neighborhood. I, I was in Underwood Hills, which is a part of this CID. I was the neighborhood president. And so I'm a dad and I'm a deacon, which means my faith carries me a very long way. So when I ran for city council, I ran on a platform of restoring the public trust and integrity. When I ran up against a long-standing uh, city council member incumbent that was encumbered and challenged with ethics, and I won. Because corruption is a crime. And with corruption being a crime, it tears at the fabric of our public trust. It, it tears at our fabric today, and it tears at our prosperity tomorrow. So we can't have a mayor that can fight crime in the city of Atlanta when they're facing federal investigations. And so right now, I think it's time for us to look at how we make opportunities for everyone in the city of Atlanta. That's why I started the technology career program at TechBridge, where I take people from survival to success by training them on high demand skills in technology. On average, they're getting $56,000 a year. A person went from Walmart to now they are making $60,000 at NCR. That's the kind of change. No one else up here has ever been able to transform somebody's lives. Hundreds of people have come through the program that I created. I've been the leader on affordable housing for the last eight years on city council. With me as mayor, we're gonna build or restore up to 20,000 housing units in the next eight years if you give me that opportunity. We want to make sure that we have affordable housing for, for nurses, for, doc, for, for uh, our you know, firefighters, for our police, and for our teachers. We want to make sure that Atlanta is able to make sure that it's for everyone. And so part of that is we can't have a prosperous Atlanta and an equitable Atlanta until we have a safe Atlanta. So we have to make sure that we get this crime under control. And I have a plan that's called the Safe Atlanta Plan. S10, I'll get to that under the, uh, under the public safety part of this. But one thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna debate a lot of things, but one thing that we can't debate is that we want to make sure we have an ethical, honest, and effective government, and I'll be your mayor, and I'll do that every single day. My name is Andre Dickens, and I pray that you allow me to be your mayor. Thank you.